So when Black Country Design released the newest version of Resolve, Resolve 17, one of the new features that I haven't really seen too many people talk about is the they added the ability to use track mats right on the edit page. So you can see the effect right here that I have a text plus saying Resolve 17 and I'm using it as a track mat between these two tracks. So you can see the one track through the other. And you can also use mats too as well. So one uses transparency for the track mat and the other one uses luminance. So you can use it as a mat. So it's fairly straightforward how to set it up. Basically click on the have you set up you have your video on the bottom. Then you have your track mat and the track in between above it. And then you have your other track above the track mat. And then come to the inspector and you click on your top clip here. You come down to composite. And normally it would be set up here to normal. So you want to scroll down to these new settings here, which we have foreground alpha, inverted alpha, luminance, and inverted luminance. So if you're going to have something with alpha and you want to use that for the top track you choose foreground that's what you're always going to use for the for the top track and then on your track mat come down go to make sure you're in settings and include the same thing composite and again if you're going to be using alpha choose alpha otherwise it was just normally you wouldn't even see it you just see the top track if you set that to alpha and then see the track mat and then the same thing goes for the, if you're using a mat and you're using, going to be using luminance. So the top track, still set the foreground, but you're going to set the, click on the bottom track here and set that to luminance. Oh, you can see it, but if you go to luminance, then you can see your mat through and it could be animated mat, whatever you have. So that is a uh, pretty useful feature that they added in Resolve 17. Again, not too many people were talking about it, but hopefully this video showed you how to use it. And thank you for watching it.